Lenny Bruce's How to Talk Dirty and Influence People serves as both a memoir and a manifesto, capturing the essence of his provocative comedic style and the social milieu of his time. Bruce, often hailed as a pioneer of stand-up comedy, employs his unique brand of humor to challenge societal norms, articulate his views on censorship, and explore the intricacies of human relationships. The book is structured around Bruce's life experiences, weaving personal anecdotes with his comedic routines, which blend the raunchy with the profound. Through a candid narrative voice, he discusses his struggles with fame, addiction, and the relentless pursuit of truth in a world rife with hypocrisy. This interplay between humor and vulnerability is central to Bruce's narrative, as he invites readers into his chaotic life, revealing the personal cost of his quest for authenticity. One of the key themes in Bruce's work is the concept of language as a tool for both liberation and oppression. He masterfully navigates the intersection of comedy and social commentary, using explicit language not merely for shock value but as a means to confront societal taboos. His discussions about sex, drug use, and religion serve as a critique of the moral standards imposed by society. Bruce challenges readers to reconsider the boundaries of acceptable discourse and highlights the absurdities of the cultural norms that govern human interactions. Bruce's approach to comedy is inherently subversive. He utilizes the form as a vehicle for social critique, often blurring the lines between the personal and the political. His humor is steeped in a deep understanding of the absurdity of life, and he encourages his audience to embrace their own imperfections. This invitation to authenticity resonates throughout the book, as Bruce reflects on the nature of truth and the fear that often accompanies self-expression. In doing so, he presents comedy as a powerful means of confronting and dismantling societal expectations. In addition to exploring the themes of language and authenticity, Bruce's narrative provides insight into the nature of fame and the entertainment industry. He candidly discusses the paradoxes of celebrity, revealing how success can lead to isolation and alienation. Bruce's experiences in the world of stand-up highlight the tension between artistic integrity and commercial success, illustrating the compromises that many artists make in pursuit of acceptance. His reflections on the pitfalls of fame serve as a cautionary tale, emphasizing the importance of staying true to oneself amidst external pressures. Another significant aspect of Bruce's narrative is his exploration of the relationship between comedy and freedom of speech. His relentless battles with authorities over obscenity charges and censorship provide a stark commentary on the limitations imposed on artistic expression. Bruce argues that humor should not be stifled by societal norms, advocating for a broader understanding of freedom of speech that encompasses all forms of expression, even those deemed controversial. This perspective is especially relevant in contemporary discussions surrounding censorship and the role of comedy in societal discourse. Moreover, Bruce's candid discussions about his personal struggles with addiction and mental health add layers of complexity to his narrative. He does not shy away from the darker aspects of his life, instead choosing to confront them head-on. By sharing his vulnerabilities, he humanizes himself and fosters a deeper connection with his audience. This authenticity is a hallmark of Bruce's comedic style, as he deftly navigates the interplay between humor and pain, inviting his readers to engage with the raw truths of existence. In conclusion, How to Talk Dirty and Influence People transcends the boundaries of a typical memoir, offering a rich tapestry of humor, social commentary, and personal reflection. Lenny Bruce's fearless exploration of language, societal norms, and the nature of truth resonates deeply, challenging readers to confront their own biases and assumptions. His legacy as a groundbreaking comedian is firmly established in this work, as he deftly navigates the complexities of human existence with wit and candor. Ultimately, Bruce's narrative serves as a powerful reminder of the importance of authenticity, the value of humor as a tool for social change, and the enduring struggle for freedom of expression.